today I'm here with a super exciting announcement video. Cramathon is back. We are hosting a mini round for a weekend from August 2nd to August 4th, so Friday to Sunday. If you guys are unaware, usually Cramathon is a readathon that myself, Dylan from Dylan is reviewing, Julia from Julia Sapphire, and Allie from Hardback Hoarders usually hosts around the end of the year so that you can read and cram a whole bunch of books at the end of the year so that you can complete your Goodreads goal. But we've decided that we want to do a little mini version as well this year, so like I said, August 2nd to August 4th, we're hosting Cramathon. So as always, we have a couple challenges for you guys to try to complete. Since this is only a weekend version of Cramathon, we have four challenges instead of our usual seven. So our first challenge is to read a book that is 200 pages or less. We have this challenge every single time we host this readathon because the whole point of Cramathon is to read as many books as possible in a very short amount of time so that y'all can get your Goodreads goals completed. The second challenge that we have is to read a 2019 release, so obviously pretty self-explanatory. Read a book that was released in 2019. Our third challenge is to give an author a second chance, so this might be an author that you've DNF'd before or one that you've read a previous book from but didn't really enjoy it all that much but you want to try it again. So here's your opportunity for that. Our fourth and final challenge is to read three books. This is a three-day readathon, so a book a day or if you're a real speedy reader, maybe you're going to read like two in one day, three in one day, who knows? It's up to you, but just complete three books. And then just to spice things up, we decided that we were going to try something new this round, so we are introducing vlogger challenges. I'm personally a huge fan of reading vlogs. I love watching them, so we decided that we were going to give you guys a little incentive to actually film a reading vlog for Cramathon, so we have four challenges for this as well. So the first challenge that we have for our vlogger challenges is to create a bullet journal spread. I am the least creative person in the entire world, and I don't do art, so this one will be interesting for me. I don't even own a bullet journal, so... We'll see if we actually complete that one. The second challenge that we have is to just post your reading vlog for Cramathon. Y'all can use the hashtag Cramathon and make us feel super special if you want, but just upload a vlog. Easy peasy. Our third challenge is for the bookstagrammers that may be participating, and it is to film or post about your process of the behind the scenes of a bookstagram picture. Personally, I do not have the patience to take bookstagram pictures, but I have so much like respect for people who do it, and they always look so nice, and I don't understand how people do it, but I would love to see how to do it. And then the fourth challenge for vloggers is to just read somewhere that is not in your house. This one probably will be very hard for me because the only other place I read is at work and I cannot film at work so we'll see how well this goes for me. Maybe I'll just read outside, I'll like take a walk to the park or something, who knows. But yeah, those are our vlogger challenges for this round. Alright guys, so that's my little announcement. Cramathon is back August 2nd to 4th. Hopefully you guys can join us. I'm really excited about it. We've never done like a weekend version of it, so hopefully we have a lot of participants. Let me know down below if you plan on participating, and please post your TBR because I want to see what you guys are reading, and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye!